What's up guys? Today I want to talk about injuries, sicknesses and things to keep you from training. Stay tuned. So, there's gonna be times where you're sick, uh, you get hurt, your lower back, your rotator cuff, uh, in your wrists, your knees, your ankles, things like that, you know, and other things stop you from going to the gym. I just want you guys to understand that it's gonna happen. So, you, when you're sick or you're hurt, you don't want to force anything. Okay, you want to do enough to progress because what happens is if you go to the gym and you force something you get yourself hurt more and put you sideline you for a longer time so you have to take into consideration all those things even though you're, you're temporarily taking time off for of being sick or being injured you're gonna grow back stronger okay so what you want to do is, if you're injured from any gym activities, you want to practice movements from where you got injured. So let's say rotate the cuff. So practice like uh, uh, shoulder movements, like lateral movements without weights, uh, front movements without weights, shrugs without weights. You know what I mean? Or like if you're injured, your lower back, lower back extensions. Uh, Touching your toes, no, twisting uh, left and right, things like that. And when you're sick, for many sicknesses, make make sure your nutrition is on check. So make sure you get all your vitamins, all your minerals. Uh, like getting something like a multivitamin, or even upping your protein, upping your calories actually could help you uh, recover faster. Okay, help uh, getting your antioxidants to get flush your body out of certain things. Your sickness is fighting to get rid of. Uh, what else, guys? Just making sure your nutrition is on check. The calories are a bit higher. You sleep. You sleep more. And as for training, making sure you practice movements. Okay. And besides that, guys, I wouldn't really force anything. I know people like myself that love the gym, that need to go in every day, feel like they'll lose strength but really you you will gain from it you know because once you're back a hundred percent your muscles are fully recovered then you'll be stronger you know you may need uh to practice uh w the movements you were doing before to get the muscle memory back and to get the weight you were doing back but it will all come back guys don't force it because you force it things will get worse and it may be something you can't come back from so that's something to consider so my answer to the question uh for you being injured or sick to take time off the gym take time off doing uh movements with weight with to the area that is hurt you know what i'm saying so if your lower back is hurt i'd not i wouldn't do any lower body movements if your if your rotator cuff is hurt i wouldn't do any heavy bench press any shoulder press things like that you know what i'm saying so be cautious be aware too on what parts of your body are injured and what exercises work what parts of your body and things like that you know what i'm saying so if your lower back is hurt that doesn't mean you can't do upper body stuff or if your upper body is hurt that can't that doesn't mean you can't do lower body stuff so things like that be conscious of that so yeah so the answer to my question is take time off stretch Make sure you uh, work on movements uh, to where in your body you're injured and the rest is time. That's it. That's it. All right, guys. I hope you liked the short video. Just wanted to talk about that. And I promise you guys, you will not lose anything. Okay? You will come back stronger. So, yeah. So I hope you guys liked the video. Make sure to hit the like button. Make sure to subscribe. And uh, comment if you have any questions too. That'll help a lot. Or comment if you have any ideas of what I should talk about in another video. You know, I'll, I'll love for that. Let's do this together. Let's let's interact, you know. Anyway, guys, that's that's it. I'm out. Peace. Yeah. Yeah, yeah.
Gucci on my belt, bought a necklace for myself, bought just happy for myself, spent them black.